Hey everybody, it's five past one on Friday the 29th of May 2015 and I just got in a, in the post uh, a, um, a special delivery as the postman put it, uh, my arcade block uh, for the month, uh, which I'm actually really surprised by because uh, I got an email a couple days ago saying your arcade block ships this week and normally when they do that uh, it's normally ships around a Thursday and then I receive it like the uh, following Tuesday but it's turned up today so no complaining but uh, just really surprised the items we got told we would be getting would be uh, this month would be uh, a Metal Gear Solid item a Zelda item and a South Park Sticker Truth item. Now, uh, Zelda I just expect now. But the other two games I love to bits. They are easily like up there on my favourite franchises. So, uh, I'm really curious to see which the, uh, are the official items kind of thing. Uh, which one's going to be the t-shirt. I won't mind, you know, could do without another Zelda t-shirt. But uh, uh, it would be nice. I mean, I, mean, I wouldn't mind if it, the others were you know, like Metal Gear was a t-shirt or South Park was a t-shirt, but uh, it'd be nice if we get official items of the other things. But uh, yeah, let's uh, open this up and uh, see what we get inside. Um, I'm really, I uh, can't wait for uh, Metal Gear 5 at the moment. It's, uh, I've played Ground Zeroes and uh, really disappointed by uh, Keeper Sutherland now as a voice of Snake, but uh, anyway, I just wanted to mention that while uh, unboxing. So, what we got? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Okay, I'm immediately happy. I'm really, really happy. Okay, this is worth it. The South Park item is, is a Grand Wizard Cartman figurine. And the reason why I'm extra happy about this is because I never got the uh, uh, the Grand Wizard um, collector's edition of the game, which came with like the big map of South Park and the like plush. I don't think it was plush, but it was a, a big figurine of uh, Wizard Cartman. So uh, I'm so glad I got that. I mean, apparently you can get like uh, you know Paladin butters and Fancy Kenny and uh kyle and uh, stan but uh i i would have been happy with any of those uh but uh, i am glad i got the carpet one because that was uh, something i was kind of tempted if i'd had the money you know like if i got some money so a bit uh, saved up i would have happily gone and bought the uh collector's edition of the game but um that's awesome i'm gonna have to look for that now i know that the uh, others are available i'm gonna have to go uh, look for those uh, to collect them because they would look awesome up on my shelf so I'm very happy with that straight off the bat I should have got the t-shirt out first but I picked that up out of curiosity because I just saw the uh, ah it's the kid robot ones yeah oh, awesome I like that even you know what um back when uh, South Park was popular and they had the uh, plush toys they kind of looked like them but at the same time some of the toys did not look much like them but at least uh, that looks like them so uh, I'm happy about that. Um, next up, we'll get the t-shirt out, I guess. And it is. I don't know what. It's like a um, fighting star t-shirt. It's like creature select and it's got... It's like Final Fantasy, like Chocobo and uh, the, uh, yeah, me, I don't like that. <laughs> That's a bit pants. Um, yeah, I, okay, whatever. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm really wishing it was uh, like Metal Gear or Zelda now. Um, I get it. I, it, it's fun, but I'm really not all that bothered by it, so uh, that's a bit disappointing. I guess if you're like Final Fantasy or, or whatever else this is, <laughs> I'm kind of really, really, like, I'm pretty sure I recognise a couple of them. 
I know these two are from Final uh, Final Fantasy. Um, I don't recognise any of the others. I mean, that looks like a fucking fireball out of Mario, but <laughs> I know it's not. But um, yeah, I that's really just what that's a throwaway T-shirt. That is that's a um, I, I keep moaning about how I don't have like a a rough around kind of T-shirt because all of my other ones I love enough to uh, not rough them up. Uh, but that's a uh, that's a nighttime shirt. That is. That's, <laughs> I, that's, you know what? That's the first T-shirt I've genuinely, at least like the Zelda ones, even I've been really happy with. But uh, yeah, that's a bit. <clears throat> um. So oh well, that's that. Um. Awesome. Ooh, we have a box. Relatively heavy box. Um. Okay. What's in the box? But not be another bloody salt and pepper shake. <laughs> it's ooh, a glass. Ah. Oh, no, it's not. It's ah, I get it. It's a health jar. It's like the Zelda item is like a health jar. That's pretty cool. Has it got full health though? <laughs> that's quite pretty. No use for it, but um, no, that's quite funny. Oh no, it's just Oh wow, that's quite a <laughs> that's quite a hefty stopper on that. What the hell? Look, you can't even really put it back in. Jeez, oh, that sounds so rude. Oh jeez. Oh cool. It's all swirly on the bottom. Can't really see. Might be able to see that. Um that's nice. I am surprised. I mean it's a very basic item, but that's quite nice. You know what? I love this. I keep bitching about Zelda and this, that, and the other. And yeah, actually, all the Zelda items we've gotten, except for that stupid little pixie thing I got there once. Um, actually, all the Zelda items have been pretty cool. So, um, yeah. <laughs> I don't have a use for it, but actually that might come in handy. And it is quite, it's really nice and pretty, actually. So, um. I don't get the point of it, but as the older items go, it's not bad. So, okay. <laughs> this is going to be one of those bizarre kind of boxes. Okay. So, the Metal Gear Solid item that I was really looking forward to getting is a military cap with very faintly foxhound uh, stamped on. <laughs> and you know what's even funnier about this? Is two sex. I actually own a military cap for my Stargate costume. <laughs> so I now have two. Uh, this one's a bit more olive green than the other one. Um, and of course, yeah, you know, it's got a foxhound stamped on it. Um, but, uh, okay. Um, I would have liked something with, like, snake on or, you know, anything. But this is a bit pants. <laughs> oh, my God. I mean, also, that foxhound is so faintly stamped I mean you can see it because I'm showing it up to the camera but because it's black on olive green um, you know I could go around wearing this and no, nobody's gonna go oh my god that's a Metal Gear that's a Metal Gear hat um because <laughs> it's on the top of the peak so um yeah that's kind of really I was so when they announced a Metal Gear item in the box I was so happy. I was like, finally, finally a, um, you know, Metal Gear. I mean, I've said, you know, we've had very similar games time and time again. Um, and finally, we had like the hard hitting uh, games. I mean, I said, you know, it would have been nice to have something different for uh, the Kingdom Hearts one last month. But I was so looking forward to actually, this is quite nice, well padded, I will say around the headband. Um, it's quite a heavy duty cap, but I was so looking forward to getting this. And 
now to just get that that's yeah i'm so disappointed that's 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 really sad <laughs> oh that's my biggest I, I was so happy when i got the south park item and that i would have much preferred if the metal gear item had been the t-shirt now that's really lame oh well <laughs> Anyway, next up, what we got? Is that a wrapper the parappa thing? I think it's a magnet. I haven't got anything around to test it on. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's a magnet. Um Rapper the rapper thing because he's got the microphone and that looks like his hand. Um, used to be an excellent game. I think they just did a new one recently, I'm not sure. Uh, but it's a bit blare, but I, I'm not I'm not a huge fan of uh, Parappa, but uh, it could be from somebody else. Something else, somebody's gonna turn around and go, No, that's that's clearly from something else, and I will completely understand that if that is. But, um, yeah, it's, it's kind of cool. If you're a big fan of that franchise, then that'll be, uh, the uh, microphone is 3D. Uh, otherwise, it's, uh, I, otherwise it's, um, flat. But, uh, it's a nice little magnet. It's a nice little addition. You know, better than a freaking military cap! <laughs> um... And the last item is freaking awesome. Oh my god, I want that on my fucking. Oh, I gotta put this on my mobility scooter. Blue shell on board, baby! <laughs> oh yeah! Just. Oh, that's awesome. I sell a window sticker, uh, but I can probably adjust it to. Uh, Stick on my scooter. That's awesome. I like that. <laughs> my mate Jane, she's going to be like, I want that when I get a car. She's going to put it on date her boyfriend's car, probably. <laughs> oh my god. That's awesome. Oh, I like that. Oh, that's worth it. Warning choking hazard. So many bad jokes to be made. Even better, the fact I'm wearing a toad shirt. Um, oh, I like that. That's pretty cool. It's that kind of thing that I would normally buy on eBay. So the fact that I haven't actually had to buy it. I mean, yeah, yeah, I paid for the arcade block and that. But uh, actually, there's been quite a few. I've liked quite a few of the things in this. It's been a lot more. Uh, it's been a lot better than last month's one. So, uh, yeah. So that I am genuinely happy with. What's it say on Oh, it's a wooden magnet, really? Kick punch wood magnet. Kick punch, it's all in the mind. If you have a memo, if you have a memo, I'm sure you'll find this wooden magnet is sure to hold it to your refrigerator where you could find it. Well, I was hoping that that would clear up the uh, crap of it, but uh, yeah, I'm uh, I love the, the, the way they do it, like the uh, old. Super NES cards, um, but uh, yeah, no, this I'm happy with. Uh, like I say, even the jar I'm happy with. Um, the figurine definitely happy with. Um, the cat own one. <laughs> I just I I cannot stress. I know I've said it. I cannot stress how much I was looking for a Metal Gear uh, Metal Gear Solid item, and uh, that just has not fulfilled that. So, um, um, yeah, I'm genuinely disappointed about that. Genuinely, and the T-shirt just did not do it for me uh, this month. Uh, but generally, 
I guess on average I'm happy with it. I mean, I mean the items again. I could probably go on uh, Amazon and find that for like thirteen quid alone. So um, somebody will probably correct me on that, but it's probably at least a tenner. Uh, like I say, the uh, blue shell on board uh, thing I would definitely buy normally, and I think last time I was looking around they were about six seven pounds. So. Uh, uh, actually, it's all—it's pretty much evened itself out regarding you know what I would buy and stuff like that. So um, yeah, just—it's okay. A lot better than last month's one. Hasn't got a stupid magazine in that I'm not going to read. And last month's one was genuinely, uh, except for the CD and stuff. Uh, in comparison, uh, it looks like they're trying to put like the bigger items in. Um, they just seem to be struggling with franchises. Uh, now, I know most people are probably going to be happy about a uh, Metal Gear hat, but, um, yeah, I just... Uh, it's nice that they're trying, but I am starting to get a bit... Eh, about this whole thing. Uh, to be honest, the way it's been the last couple of months, I don't know how much longer I'm going to continue getting these. Uh I'm going to keep trying, uh, but I am starting to, I'm not as really big on them as I was when I first uh, started getting the, uh, when the, the arcade block first started. So, um, so yeah, so I'm really sorry. I've been a bit, I've been a bit bipolar, but this box has made me quite bipolar. Uh, it's, it's a very hit and miss kind of uh, thing. So, um, but on average, there's actually more stuff here than I like that I liked than I didn't like, uh, which is silly because actually two of the items are the ones I really like, and the Zelda item is really like just it's cool, but it's a bit bland. So, um, actually, there's only been what five items in this whole box. Uh, now I know that's because of the weight of say the figure and the uh, uh, jar. But uh, five items actually isn't that much. Oh, no, sorry. Six items. Forgot about the wooden magnet. Um, that apparently made in USA! Um, yeah, I completely forgot about the magnet. <laughs> uh, uh, which is okay. I, I, I will put it on my uh, fridge. But, um, okay, six items. Uh, so, yeah, the, it's, I, did, I did like the magnet. It was cool. Um, but yeah, it's very hit and miss. Uh, I think, I think if you're a Final Fantasy fan and, and you get the uh, the, the fighting uh, one, uh, the T-shirt would be uh, definitely up your alley. But uh, otherwise, it's been a very hit and miss box. And I know I've just said that about five times, and I could have probably saved you the time. But uh, but that's May's arcade block, which actually turned up before the next month. So uh, <laughs> anyway, uh, that's it for now. Uh, if you're interested in any of the items, uh, do uh, check out uh, nerdblock.com, I think it is. And uh, um, we'll see what uh, next... I don't think there's been anything to say what's going to be in next month's one yet. So uh, we'll see. Uh, but uh, looking forward to next month's one. And uh, thank you all for watching. Uh, please like, subscribe and, and all that stuff. Uh, more videos coming soon. My voice, as you can hear, is uh, starting to come back. I've been doing uh, the last couple of uh, Movie Magic and Gaming Gurus chats, so uh, that's been going ahead. Good, uh, Love being back with that. And, of course, uh, uh, did an excellent chat with uh, John, who's a regular uh, watcher of our chat. So, um, uh, yeah, it's nice to be back and getting back. And I've been at the computer the last couple of days uh, working on videos and... and uh, some artwork and stuff so I'm slowly getting back I've still got a cough uh, which actually I'm surprised I've uh, not had during this uh, video but um, I'm getting back so uh, hopefully we'll be back with more soon certainly hoping to uh, fingers crossed start back with the uh, movie and night uh, reviews next week and uh, please check them out like I say please like and subscribe if you get the chance and uh, please let me know what you thought of these items. I know Malcolm will reply and go, it's cheap tack. Um, but uh, no, please, uh, if, if you're, you would have loved a foxhound hat, then uh, please comment and stuff. But uh, 
for now though, this is Sketch signing out and saying thank you all for watching. Take care everybody.